illegal small-scale mining activities popularly referred to as Galamse, destroying the land and polluting water bodies. In 1989, government, worried by illegal mining activities, passed the PNDC Law 218 to legalize small-scale mining in a bid to control Galamse. However, it appears to be yielding no result as illegal mining is on the increase in several parts of the country, especially in the western and eastern regions. In a bid to toughen punishment for Galamse operators and illegal miners, the Judicial Service, with support from the Minerals Commission, has been engaging magistrates and justices on the need to deter illegal mining activities. Minister of Lands and Natural Resources, Mike Hammer, wants punishment increase for offenders. The laws are quite clear. So there is nothing like you don't have any opportunity to, to have your activities regularized. All that you need, you, you have to understand that the law does not permit legal mining. If you want to mine, the processes are there, the procedures are there. Go through the process. Get a license and drive. Get a license and mine. What's the problem? He called for collaboration from all stakeholders, including the judiciary, in the fight against Galamsey. A Supreme Court judge, Justice Jones Duche, reiterated the need for some outmoded laws to be repealed to deter offenders. He also advised traditional leaders who offer lands for these activities to ensure the environment and natural resources are protected. 